Quickly ask you also about guns. You, as well, obviously the senator from Connecticut, have been such a proponent for some kind of action. You've been talking to the White House, we understand. The president has keeps pointing to mental health issues. It's not, uh, it's people who pull the trigger. It's not the gun. Are you getting encouragement from the White House staff that he is willing when you all come back to do something about background checks or other gun, gun measures, or is he going to revert back to this mental health NRA mantra? I wish I knew the answer to that question, uh, Andrea. She, the president uh, and I had a conversation some weeks ago in which he expressed you know, his desire to uh, pass a meaningful background checks reform bill. Uh, I read that to mean one that would not be supported by the NRA and the gun lobby. And we are, as we speak, in discussions with the White House about just that, significant changes to our background check system to make sure that more guns are subject, more gun sales are subject to background checks. And thus far, the White House is at the table, um, and I, I see a path forward to getting something before the Senate that would that could pass. But it can only pass the Senate if the president supports it. Uh, so, you know, ask me in a couple of weeks as to whether the president's interest is sincere. But I think it's good news that we're sitting down and talking about this.